Greetings fellow programmers, uh, my name is Pavel and I am here with a C++ exercise from the book uh, starting out with uh, C++ from control structures through objects and this exercise is actually control structures exercise. We are going to make an app that compares two rectangles or the area of rectangles. We will be, uh, which is calculated length times width of rectangle. That's how the area of rectangle is calculated and we will write a program that asks for the length and width of two rectangles and then the program should tell the user which rectangle has the greater area or if they are the same. So this is actually fairly simple. We only have two rectangles to compare. So we will compare is the first rectangle greater than the other than the second? Is the uh, first rectangle smaller than the second or is rectangle first or rectangle one equal to rectangle two so it's gonna be if else if and else statement but at the beginning we of course we need some uh, variables and I'm gonna do doubles first rectangle I'll call it width uh, and first uh, rec rectangle uh, length. Those will be the values that the user will enter and um, we will get a double second rectangle width and second rectangle uh, length. So that these are two uh, Oh, four variables and that's all we really need so first we're gonna ask the user for an input so C out and please enter the length and width of the first rectangle and we can enter I'll just do and line and on the new line we can enter the first rectangle what are we asking first the length length and width so sin c in first rectangle width i'm sorry so first rectangle length and uh, we will just capture the first rectangle width as well now we will do the same for the second i'll just copy paste it except this one will be second so and this one will be second length and second width so uh, the second rectangle not because I misspelled this thing uh, rectang rectangle all right first rectangle width all right, so uh, now we have uh, our variables, now we have the values for them, and we can do the if statement. Like I said before, it's gonna be if, else if, and uh, else. Now we could uh, actually calculate the, uh, the area first for both the rectangles and assign it to a variable, but we don't really have to, we can do it directly in our if statement like this, if, and within if if our first rectangle uh, length times first rectangle width if this uh, results in a greater than uh, our second rectangle length multiplied by second rectangle width in other words, if the result of the multiplication of this multiplication is greater than the result of this multiplication, which means that this is the multiplication for the area of the first rectangle, this one is the multiplication for the area of the second rectangle. So if the first one is greater than the second, we can do, we can output something like C out and area of first rectangle is greater than area of the 
second rectangle. All right, and um, if this is not true, we can check. Oh, I'm not add else yet. Else, if, and I will just copy paste this because it's gonna be the same thing except it will ask if the area is of the first rectangle is smaller than the area of sec uh, the second rectangle. So I will copy paste that as our answer. It will see out the area of first rectangle is smaller than the area of the second rectangle. And finally, if it's not greater and if it's not smaller, we know they're the same. So else, the only third option is it, that they are the same. So we will see out area of first rectangle is the same as area of the second rectangle and this is all there is to this exercise this is a simple like, if statement that compares the result of a multiplication uh, for greater smaller or if neither then we just we don't have to check if they are the same because they have to be if it's not greater and if it's not smaller then they are the same all right so let me build it see if uh, i made any errors there and it's building slowly but surely yep success so let's run it and i will do let's say length five and with five for the first one and the second one i will do five and six in other words the first rectangle is smaller than the second rectangle and it says area of first rectangle is smaller than area of second rectangle so let's try when the first one is greater so five and five here area of first rectangle is greater okay and now let's make them the same five 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 and five is the same as the second rectangle so it, it's working fine I mean again this is a very simple if statement and this is the solution to this uh, simple exercise so if it helped you please leave a like share with your friends leave a comment and as always I'll see you next time and happy coding take care